everyone, this is Oliver Harper here and this is a let's play on the arcade version of Batman. Now I don't think many people are aware of this version, uh, there was obviously home console versions for the NES and the Sega Mega Drive and the 16-bit Amiga versions and 8-bit Micro ones for the Spectrum and Commodore 64. Now the arcade version plays a little bit differently, um, the graphics are probably the best out of the, out of the bunch, but um, the gameplay is a little bit frustrating to uh, to play, so um, I'll put some credits in and let's see what it's like. Now you can choose between three lies or seven. Uh, well, pfft, I'm going with seven. I mean, it's, I mean, I've played this a few times before, so this is obviously quite fresh for new people who haven't seen it. Um, there we go. Um, Animation-wise, it's 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 not too bad, and it's quite obviously the levels are all very quite detailed. Uh, this level is very straightforward. It's just walking along, punching people, and nothing much really going on at the moment. But it does get insanely hard later on, and really unfair because Batman himself does play a little bit clunky. It's like a bit of a delay when he when he attacks. Get in the car. That's quite cool. Now it has these weird, there's two, I think there's three scenes of these sort of driving segments. Uh, there's two in the car and there's one where you're in the bat wing, got to uh, capture all the uh, balloons that's uh, filled with gas. Um, so you've got to just take out all these cars for some reason. There's no, there's no like challenge really behind it all. You've just got to shoot all the black cars, I think. In the film or in the, because uh, he, when he drives the car, he has to hook onto like the side, um, like the lamp, lamp posts on the side, and swings around corners. Um, but in the other games, it, they they try and copy that. But in that, it's just, you're just shooting cars, which is a bit repetitive, really. You can you can get different weapons like the uh, batarang or the um, the claw gun, which you can like you can go upwards. I think I might have dismissed it actually. Where is it? Oh, there it is. I need that. Bat rope. Here we go. So you hold up and fire, and way here we go. Look at that idiot. Pfft. Oh, see, sometimes you can just get taken out by some of the acid that drops on some of the pipes. It's a bit annoying because sometimes you can barely see them. There's little bits of gas there. Be really quick about it. Whoop. Oh shit, I've got to drop here. It's really weird with like, a lot of arcade games are late 80s and early 90s. Well, actually early 90s, I begin to phase them out as sort of platform style games. But I think, oh, I just died again, what the fuck? So you can just die so quickly. I mean, the energy bars at the bottom, you think, okay, I've got, I can be hit like five times or more, but it's literally one of those is, is, is your life. So it, it cut, when you get hit, it, it cuts in half. So you only get hit twice before you actually die. Oh, what am I doing? Up here, Batman, you idiot. Right, here we go. Go away. Whoop. <laughs> you fell into the acid, what a dick. Go up here. Go away. Whoa. Oh, there's a pipe there, that's alright. I'm gonna get. Oh, shit. Acid, acid, acid. Whoa. I mean, graphically, it's quite faithful to the film. It's got all the levels. Oh, here goes Jack Napier there. Got to get him into the acid. Nice. Dun, 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 dun. Now, this level is so frustrating. Because you've got guys... Oh, look, I'm dead already. You've got guys who jump out the paintings and guys with guns, obviously. And, like, come on, look, are we... Oh, I'm nearly dead already. I keep. Oh, look at that! Bullshit. Now, beware, I may lose my temper playing this because this game is annoying. Get that shit off the screen! If I keep moving quick. Oh, no, I'm dead. That's right. This game is um, a little bit forgiving where if you get so far into it, you don't have to restart from the beginning. You can just like continue from where you were. Oh my god, so many bad guys. I'm dead oh god, see this gets swamped. 
with thugs. Go away. Fuck off. No, I'm nearly dead. No, I'm not going to be dead again. This is... Oh, that's close. Jump up, Batman, you nonce. Need some more health quick. Ah! Oh, come on, I'll, I'll jump there. Go away, you cocks. If I get stuck on this level, I'm going to go batshit crazy. Which some people probably want me to do. <laughs> but god damn it, I'm going to go ahead. Let's see if I can get past it. Hey! Gas grenades. Oh! Ball bags. <sighs> this is going to be repetitive now. Go away. Dun 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 dun. The hell is this weird move? <laughs> Look at this fancy kick. It's well funny. Go away, you're gonna give me that gas thing. Thank you. Dun 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 dun. Oh, this is fucking annoying. These deadly balloons are gonna kill me. Whoa. As I was saying earlier, I mean, there isn't platform arcade games sort of fizzled out in the early 90s. I mean, it is really a console based sort of platform, really. It it's definitely suits the consoles better than arcades. I mean, you get some classics like Shinobi that play, do like platforming. And Strider. Oh come on, man! That's bullshit. Dun 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 dun. Back rank's so weak. Come on, get off, get off. Ooh. Dun 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 dun. dun. Oh man! He gets more like gas gas grenades. Oh, let me get them, fuck's sake! Why would he get them? Fucking hell. Ugh. Dun 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 dun. Yay! Come on, should be the Joker here soon. I've got to save Vicky Vale. Fucking hell! Attack from everywhere! Same old thugs. Oh, come on! Hey, it's Vicky. Whee! Bill. Only shoot what? Oh, green ones. Oh, bullets got rockets. Da -da. Da -da -da -da. I mean, this is a bit like um, the arcade version of Robocop 2 as a driving sequence, which it does work a bit better actually than this. This is just a bit pointless. It's just to sort of extend the life of the game because just instead sort of having this continuous platform levels so of just try to mix it up a bit, which is which is fair enough, but it could have been a little bit more creative. Oh, here we go. It's the end. I'll be very careful, Batman. Ooh. Go this way, up here. Oh, go fuck off. Oh, completely missed him. Hit detection's a bit shit in this, to be honest. Hey! Fuck, going up there. Going up the ladder. Oh, fuck's sake, man. That's bullshit. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, 
I'll leave these guys alone. <laughs> yeah. Dun 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 dun. His, his jump is so pathetic. It's like you have to be really on the on the edge of the the ledge to jump onto the next platform. Oh, sent me right back here. Sodding game. I need those batarangs. Just give Batman a gun and shoot the fuckers. But Batman doesn't kill, so we can't have that. Oh, sod you, you fucking game. Well, let's go down. Ah, I can't go down. Shit. Oh, that sends me right back to that bit again. I'm going to go mad. Oh. Fucking run it. I'm legging it. I'm legging it. Fuck this shit. So you just, oh, I thought he said towards the edge. Oh, come on, look at that. It's bullshit. That's it. Right, I'm here. Now, I think the end boss for this level is that guy with the two swords he meets in the alley in the film. But I think he's totally useless, so I should be able to kill him quite quickly. Oh, outside the theatre here. Fucking hell, carnage! Oh, come on! Look at that! So unfair, this game. That's what arcades are all like. They're just there to eat up your money as quickly as possible. And most arcade owners put everything up so fucking hard, so you just die in the first two levels. Here we go. Then. He's just twat. Oh, I've got 33 batarangs, so he should die pretty quickly. Come on. Just die, please. Da, 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 da. What's he doing? Come on! Is he dead? I think he's dead. Right, let's get in the car. Right, now now we've got to capture all the balloons. Now this, now this level is is perfectly valid to to include in the, in the game. I mean, you've got this, you've got something to do. So there's shooting stuff. You've got to try and catch the balloons. That's it. There. I'm actually missing a lot of these helicopters here. What am I doing? Ah! Oh, I completely missed that balloon. Fucking hell! Come on, get that balloon. Come on! Come on! Come on! Yay! It's quite cool they've actually tried to replicate the film's score by Danny Elfman. It's a uh, little sort of chip tune arrangement. So it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's good. Because in. I think I don't think the Mega Drive and the NES one had any of the film music in it. They had like original music, which was. You know, sounded fantastic, you know, but it sort of took away the sort of. the extra element of, of the film. Yay! I get shot down now. Oh, this level's a bitch. Fucking hate this level. Get that shit off the screen! Fucking hell! That's what we're doing. I'm dead already. I think he just shot himself then. Right, let's go up here quickly. Sod all these douchebags. Oh! Bad guy. I think you've got to fight the Joker like three, is it two or three times maybe he appears and you've just got to shoot him until he, dis until he sort of runs off. Um, oh, look at that! Put, oh, fucking put a life bar right next to an explosive weapon. Oh my god. 
Oh, annoying. Oh, I've got sleep. Oh, man. Right, let's get. Oh, I've got my gas. Fucking pricks. Um, uh. Toby should be here. Get rid of him quickly. God for that, he's fucked off. Oh no! If I've got to fight Joker again, oh, I'm gonna go mad. Oh, oh, I have to fight him again. Great. Just gotta make him fall down that hole. Oh, for fuck's sake. We dance. This game has literally like three thugs. That's it. Oh my god! Fucking Batman, you nonce! Fucking geriatric Batman. Come on! Come on, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Fall down the hole. Thank you. Take my time with this. I mustn't fuck this up. I think. Oh, this bit's annoying. No, no, you're not killing me. No, I'm in a fucking hole. I've got no fucking weapons. Great, great, thanks. Thanks, game. Let's do these poncy kicks. Oh, fuck off. Huh. Careful there. I've got eight of these bloody things left. Huh. Oh, go away, nonce. Oh, these guys take, take quite a bit of damage. Oh, come on, I shot you loads of times. You should be stunned. Go away. Alright, let's get past this prat. Two of them? Oh, come on, game. Dilly, dilly. Oh, I've got to kill Joker with five batarangs. Yeah, great. Yeah, great. So fair. Uh, okay, it's the last bit now. Look this fucking game. I've got to knock him off the bloody... Oh, I ain't going to do this. I've got to... So when you die, you, you, you keep the last batarangs from the last bit. Oh, it didn't seem to, didn't seem to have given me many this time. That's really annoying. I'm, I'm going to struggle here. Eh? So annoyed. If someone touches rebound off him, it's so. Ah, oh, come on, let's die. Oh, I'm nearly there. Fucking hell, Batman, you prat. So I'll keep knocking him backwards. All got to do. Oh, fuck you, game. Oh, I'll take my time with this. Ah, uh, <laughs> famous last words. Take my time with it, and I die. I should fire that bit, then he's going to fine. Gotcha. Oh, kick right off the edge. Take that, you dickhead. Hooray! Dun, 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 dun.
an exciting ending. Well, it's an okay game. I mean, graphically it's very good for the time. Um, it's very faithful to the film in terms of the representation of all the levels. Um, but the, the gameplay's a bit too frustrating because obviously it's an arcade game. It's, gonna, it's designed to eat up your money quickly, so they're going to put the difficulty up quite high. And they always, when you have a game of like a small amount of levels, they end up making it so difficult to sort of to artificially extend the game. That's what my name is, Bum. Here we go. Um, also, you can see why they didn't convert it to home console. So possibly the home console version is actually probably longer than that version of the arcade version. Sorry, um, NES one and probably Mega Drive ones are probably the, the best Batman games to play. But uh, I hope you've enjoyed the video and given you some insight to the arcade game. But uh, give it a go if you if you wish. But um, it's not highly recommended. Um, but I'll be back soon with another Let's Play, so look out for that soon.